There are definitely, and I just want to, you know, talk about, you know, the uh, wrong way drivers. I've gone to two of these scenes yesterday morning. I was right here on the Southfield freeway where there was one uh, wrong way driver crash. And then on May 5th, I was also at the 696 wrong way crash as well. Uh, and, you know, it's it's a concern for a lot of people, uh, especially as morning folks who are coming into work really early in the morning. And we have to be on a hyper alert basically to make sure uh, for drunk drivers and also for wrong way drivers. And I took this video on my way in this morning. This video shows uh, the other hidden danger. Those are called ghost vehicles. Ghost vehicles are uh, drivers whose headlights are not uh, on. Their taillights aren't on. They're hard to see for vehicles driving in the right direction and especially vehicles driving in the wrong direction. It's every driver's worst nightmare. Headlights coming at you while you're driving in the right direction on the freeway and the other vehicle is not. That could be very scary, you know, seeing some lights come for, to, uh, towards you. Uh, I wouldn't know what to do with them. And then... <laughs> an accident scene. Vehicles left destroyed. Some still even smoking from the violent high-speed impact. It's a fear that many Metro Detroiters have. I assume I would want to swerve out of the way, but I also think swerving could cause more of an issue. Seven Action News has tracked the number of wrong way freeway crashes. In the last six weeks alone, there have been six wrong way crashes resulting in six deaths. The first one happened on April 22nd on the Lodge Freeway. The second on April 23rd on the Southfield Freeway. The third happening on May 5th on 696. The fourth happening on May 6th on 696. The fifth on May 23rd on US 23. And then the sixth one on May 29th on the Southfield Freeway. Many 7 Action News viewers took to Facebook like Isla Smith saying, quote, this is happening far too much on Michigan freeways and highways. It's not even summer yet. Another viewer writing in, quote, how do you end up going the wrong way on the freeway, especially with the concrete barriers? Michigan State Police say that these crashes are preventable and that drivers are not paying attention to the warning and safety signs that are posted, costing lives and injuries that victims have to live with for the rest of their life. And state police say that some of these wrong way crashes are the result of drunk driving or impaired driving. Other wrong way crashes are the result of distracted driving. And speaking of distracted driving, lawmakers hope to crack down on distracted driving in the coming weeks. Reporting in Dearborn, I'm Peter Maxwell, 7 Action News. So important to drive safely, especially at this time in the morning. Peter, thank you for all your coverage.